welcome back dear students in this video i am going to discuss python program to read n numbers from the console and create a list print mean variance and standard deviation with suitable messages let's see outcome of watching this video at the end of this video you will be able to write python program to read n numbers from the console you will be able to develop a python program to print mean variance and standard deviation with a suitable messages these two will be implemented in a single program where you are going to learn how to read n numbers from the console and store in list later you will be able to find and print mean variance and standard deviation with suitable messages let's see the program statement once again we are going to read n numbers from the console and create a list develop a python program to print mean variance and standard deviation with suitable messages before i discuss the program let's see in simple what is a list because we are going to read n numbers and store in a list what is list a list is a versatile and ordered collection of elements that can contain items of different data types nothing but a list is a sequenced data which will contain values of different data types lists are mutable meaning we can add remove or modify elements after the list is created elements in list are indexed starting from zero for the first element lists are created using square brackets so example is here fruit is equal to apple banana cherry date if we see there are four elements all four elements are separated by comma and all of these four elements are of type string but we can have a elements of any data type irrespective of a data type the list will contain any types of elements so let's see what is mean variance and standard deviation mean is also called as average so here if you see mean is equal to sigma i is equal to 1 to n x of i divided by n basically we are going to find the sum of all the numbers in a list and divide that sum by n which is number of elements in the list and variance is it is simple from i is equal to 1 to n x of i minus mean square whole divided by n here x of i is every element in a list and standard deviation is simply square root of variance let's see algorithm to find the mean variance and standard deviation in step 1 we are going to read n which is length of list from the console and in step 2 we are going to read n elements and store in list in step 3 we will find sum of all the values in a list later we will calculate the mean by dividing sum by n so these two can be done in a single step we will calculate the sum of all the values in list and divide that by n so that will be a mean and in step 5 you subtract the mean from the each value in list square the result and sum up all the squared differences later to calculate the variance divide the sum of all the square differences by n which is number of values in list and to calculate the standard deviation take the square root of the variance and in last step we are going to display mean variance and standard deviation so very simple algorithm step by step procedure how we are going to implement this program based on this you can make your own flow chart what is the expected output so enter length of list here 6 nothing but number of elements in list n is equal to 6 enter number 1 2.6 enter number 2 6.3 number 3 4 number 4 3.9 number 5 is 5 number 6 is 8 mean of the list this is the list printed the mean of this list is 4.97 variance is 3.11 and standard deviation is 1.76 
With this, let's start coding. Dear students, I'm going to use Ubuntu operating system. I'm going to write the program in a terminal using VI editor. Let me open a file called program underscore three dot py. So here first I'll write the program statement. Program statement is it's a Python program to read n numbers from the console and instead of single line comment i'll use multi line comment and find mean variance instead of find i'll write print mean variance and standard deviation this is the program statement we have seen in a program we should find the square root import module math this i am importing to use the sqrt function to find square root because square root function is readily available in math for that purpose i am going to import the math after this first and foremost let me read length of list nothing but read n here n is equal to n is length of list is equal to i'll convert read value to an integer and here input enter value of n which is nothing but number of elements in list whatever the value will be entered it will be converted to a integer and will be stored in n once value of n is entered to read n elements i'm going to create an empty list named numbers numbers is an empty list which can be created using open square bracket and close square bracket this is going to create empty list now later say i am going to read n numbers from the console for that purpose let me use for loop for i in a range of n now here i'll take a variable called num num is equal to the number i'll read it as a float float input now here i'm going to use a format string f and within this enter number so i'll write within flower bracket i plus 1 which is a format string it is going to use the value of i and it'll add 1 to it initially i will be 0 0 plus 1 will be 1 it will display enter number 1 when i is 1 i 1 plus 1 will be 2 it will display enter number 2 once the user will enter it will be read using input function and converted to a float and it will be stored in a num and now i am going to append that to a list numbers numbers dot append append is a method and num will be appended like this all the num number will be read and appended to a list once we read all the numbers later find the mean so here we will calculate mean to calculate the mean it is very simple mean is equal to there is a function called sum which will find the sum of all the elements in list i'll write sum of numbers and divided by n so this is a sum divided by n sum of all the numbers divided by n and to calculate variance i'll write variance is equal to it is once again sum of x minus mean square of this it will find the square where see this x is for x in the list numbers divided by n look at dear students here variance is equal to sum of x minus mean already we have found mean x minus mean and square of this this x will be taken from a list numbers like for every x in numbers this particular equation will be calculated this equation is calculated for every x in numbers and later 
it will be divided by n and finally to calculate standard deviation so i'll write std underscore deviation standard deviation is equal to it is math dot sqrt of variance very simple and finally let us display mean variance and standard deviation this i am going to display using print function print and here i use a format string f mean of the list so let me display that list is and here let us display the mean similarly print here f variance so let me display variance and finally print standard deviation std underscore deviation so f indicates format string whatever will be written within a curly brackets or flower brackets here curly bracket along with the numbers will be replaced by the list because numbers is a list and here curly brackets along with mean will be replaced by its value that is mean value let me save this and to execute this i'll use python 3 interpreter enter the value of n which is number of elements if i enter 6 first number let me re enter 3.4 second 5 third say 5.c fourth 7 fifth 2 and sixth is 8.3 now here you can see dear students mean of list this is the list which has been created is this the mean this is variance and this is standard deviation now if you see after decimal point you have lots of digits if at all we want to restrict after decimal point to a particular number of digits like only two digits we can modify our program a little here while printing mean instead of printing it directly there is a function called format we will use a function format so where this variable mean we want to print within two decimal points you write it as 0.2 f similarly even this variance i'll use format function format this variance to two decimal points and similarly standard deviation let me use a format function format it to only two decimal points format it to two decimal points okay let me save this and once again execute this with using python 3 interpreter so this time if i enter 6 2.4 5.6 3.3 5 8 and 4 so now if you see dear stones this is the list created and the value is restricted only to two decimal points how many decimal points you can you want to see you can write it in this case i have written only 0.2 f which indicates two decimal points if at all you want only one you can write it as 0.1 f So this is a very simple program to find the mean variance and standard deviation. Hope this is clear to all of you dear students. Thank you. Thank you for watching.